Are you ready to see my new closet? I'm Jenny with Roots and Wings Furniture and this is Kristen Tobacco from The Serene Space and we just did a closet makeover which we cannot wait to share with you. Today is the big reveal day. Uh, one thing that we talked about, Kristen asked, and I can't remember if this was on camera or not, but when we first started this, you asked me if there's anything I love about my closet and I said, there's nothing. What? <laughs> like, I'm not a big clothes person. I'm not a big shoe person. Um, so. I didn't know you could love your closet. Yeah. But I gotta tell you, I love my closet. See? Can't you see? It says it all over her face right now. Yeah. Um, it is. It makes a world of a difference. Again, even if it's just a place that you're going to grab your clothes, like that's your first place you're going in the day. So yeah. you want it to feel good. And I think your business name, Serene Space, is perfect yeah. because it's it really is a serene space. It feels calm. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. All right. I'm excited to show everyone. Yeah, let's do it. Here we are in my brand new closet. If you remember before, I we had this shelf hanging here and I could hardly stand here. There was stuff all in my face. Um, and it was it was just kind of a mess. Again, we moved into this house about a year ago, um, kind of threw the things in the closet and just left it as is. So this is a huge improvement and really feels like it works well. So let's tell them what we did. Yeah, yeah, well, and again, I think you, hit the nail on the head where it's just it's open it's welcoming now and it's exciting to be in here mm -hmm. um and so that huge shelf mm -hmm. that was when i walked into the space that was the number one thing that had to go um and i don't think you've lost a lot of space by taking that out it right. wasn't being utilized right so you now have this wonderful wall mm -hmm. that showcases your jewelry that you love mm -hmm. and it's still practical and functional right. we've got some robes hanging um on the left here and then your belts mm -hmm. again easy go-to but they're not sticking out far right right so that's and it is i um this thing having your jewelry out open i'm not a huge jewelry wearer but i definitely wasn't wearing it when it was all packed away so even having a place that you can hang it and see it um, is huge uh, it makes me wear jewelry more often since i have it and i think the same with shoes in the back yeah. here right yeah so we decided to do open shelving for the shoes um, along the back wall um, i love it because it's up off the off the floor yeah. and we can see what what I, I can see what I have. Right. And so what's nice about this space is on the other end, we're going to show you, but she has some sweatshirts and pants hanging. And so it's actually pretty versatile. Mm -hmm. You can switch things back and forth mm -hmm. if need be. Mm -hmm. um, but you can see. And then we've also left one shelf just open. So perfumes, other shoes. I mean, you could showcase this area however mm -hmm. you chose. Right. But. And I did show you guys last time how we were building the... Uh, laundry basket dresser. So this is how it turned out when it's all finished. It came together so nice. And if you pull any of one of these, there's a laundry basket inside. It's full of dirty laundry. Um, that's not a prop, that's real. Um, but anyways, the whole thing will come out and I can literally take the basket and just take it right to the laundry room from there. Um, but it's super nice. It's convenient just to throw your clothes inside. Um, and ladies, my husband thinks it's so cool. He's been actually putting his clothes in here. So that's a win, right? Build yourself one of these laundry basket dressers. You never know what might happen. So I'm super excited about that. Yeah. And I have three bins. So on a good week, I can sort my clothes as I'm putting it in there. And yeah. it saves a step on laundry too. Perfect. Yeah, perfect, Yay. right? Um, what do we have over here? So on this side, we went... Um, kind of by his and hers. So all of his clothes are up top and all of hers are towards the bottom. Mm -hmm. And we had determined that the majority was all short hang. Mm -hmm. So getting caught up in the back and meeting there in the corner, there wasn't a lot of clothes that we had to worry mm -hmm. about. So we extended the full rod on the bottom. Um, and everything was color coded. Mm -hmm. We're gonna cross our fingers that for the most part, it'll stay that yeah. way. Um, but in lieu of doing a hanger makeover, right. um, we just utilized what she had and made sure everything was all plastic hangers. Again, that's just gonna help grabbing and going and just the whole feel of it. It looks good when they're all, all the same. Mm -hmm. um, and then up top, some bins, just for a few of those items that you just don't need a full dresser drawer for, um, but still easy to grab and go. Mm -hmm. um, any other? 
We did clean out a, a mm -hmm. ton of clothes. I feel like we did a good job cleaning out. Um, there's probably still more that we could clean out, but it's here and yeah. more accessible so we can see it. And if we don't end up wearing it, it's easy to get rid of it. Um, yeah, and one of the thoughts on that that we spoke about and we haven't pulled the trigger on just mm -hmm. yet, um, so you can actually take your hangers and you would normally hang them on the rod, mm -hmm. um, but instead take all of your clothes and hang them backwards and then as you wear them, you would put them back the normal way. And so this would allow you over a period of time to see what you're wearing or what you're not wearing. So we haven't pulled the trigger on it, but yeah. it's an option. Yeah, that, I think that's a great idea. It's very simple and um, would allow you to, to really know your favorites and yes. what you can get rid of. So, yes. For sure. Um, yeah, so that's it for this side. I love the bins too. Um, these bins were all from Target really inexpensive, um, just easy to stick things in, like shorts or off-season wear, extra hats, scarves, um, things that we're not grabbing every day, but it's definitely still storage that we can use up there, um, and it's very easy to access. Yeah. So, yeah. it's great. All right, let's flip the camera around, and we'll show you what's on the other side, too. Okay, in the last video, I showed you how we were building this tower. So, this is all finished. I just painted it all white and trimmed it out. It looks really nice, um, and it is great. So, we fold all of our pants. Um, I just find it easier when I'm doing laundry. That's how we do it. And this is nice because it, each cubby gives us a place to, to um, put our pants. We kind of each have our cubbies. I've got a couple down below and he's got a few for his pants and then sweatshirts up above. Um, they were right about 12 by 12 inch boxes. Um, and so they're just the right size. They're not too deep. It's not too wide that it takes up a bunch of space that we don't use. Um, and then they're they're not too tall, so um, each cubby has its own purpose. And I think it will help us not by, you know, you can see, oh, I've got five pairs of jeans, I don't need another one. Or if I get another one, you clean out, because it literally yeah. won't fit. So I think right. it's a good thing. Right, yeah. yeah, and that's exact. And just, it keeps everything organized, it's simplified, and like you said, every cubby has its purpose. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. nice. And it's nice and organized. And again, you can see it all, which is great. You can see what you got and where it is. Yeah. Um, so. And this is the area too, we were talking, you saw the shoes earlier. Mm -hmm. So you could actually swap them out mm -hmm. if you felt like you needed um, a little less space for shoes or mm -hmm. vice versa. Mm -hmm. but. Which is great. Um, and then you can't see this here, but I'm just gonna tell you about it. The bottom cubby, um, we left that space for like weights and exercise equipment, just tucked right in there. I don't, I, so I work out upstairs, and so it's nice because it's tucked away, but it's still yeah. really accessible. Um, it's even more convenient than I was putting it up on a shelf before. So um, that little space is right down there, and um, I actually really like that. It's just tucked away. You don't notice it, um, but it's got everything has its place, which I think yeah. is what we've got to. Yeah. Everything has its place, mm -hmm. um, so it'll be easy to keep clean and organized. Yeah. Yay. See? I love it. I told you I love my closet. Um, so I really hope that we inspired you to maybe try something new in your own closet, in your own space. Maybe rethinking um, what you have to just make it more functional and more beautiful in the process as well. So thank you yes, so much. You're thank welcome. You. Thank you it was enough. so much fun. Yay. So thanks for joining us on this video and we will see you next time.